Hey guys, so I am at Home Depot right now. I'm going to grab a couple of um, two by four by eights to make a Jenga set for our backyard, um, like an extra large Jenga set. So I'm gonna take you guys along with me while I grab the supplies. Let's go. I had one of these sales associates help me look for the two by four by eights. We also looked through all of them to make sure we found some really good wood, nothing that had splits in it, um, that had too many holes in it, um, because those really won't work very well for the actual tumbling towers or Jenga type pieces. Home Depot will do one cut for free. So I had them cut my wood in half so they would be able to fit in my car and then I took them home to cut them down to 8 inch little blocks. You can also cut these down to 10 and a half inches and that is a larger size so you will need to purchase more 2 by 4 by 8s. I purchased 5 and it worked perfectly fine for us but if you do the 10 inch um, size blocks you will need to purchase about 6 to 7 of the 2 by 4 by 8s. So I had to have my son help me sand these down. I started out with just a basic sander and then we had to upgrade to an electric sander because it was taking way too long. Um, but he sanded down all the corners so we wouldn't get any splinters and any split wood would come off. Then I used a gel stain that I just had in my garage and a sponge. I did two different types of gel stain. One is a Kona one and this is more of a lighter stain. I'll have the name in the description box below so make sure you guys check that out. Um, I wanted a two-tone look for these tower blocks. I also used a little bit of help staining each of these blocks. Um, like I said, we did do some dark, some light. I also did some of the dark ends dark and you'll see that more towards the end of the video. I really love how this turned out. We enjoyed playing this. It's a really fun game for outdoors for the summertime. Please make sure you hit the subscribe button if you like DIYs, home decor, and family videos. Thanks for watching. Make sure you check out the description box as well for more information.